Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Strangers in Paradise, Final Fantasy Origins. And after the last one that we did, where we ended up traveling to this place, I did go through the main mission here twice. One time with the regular squad, and a second time where I swapped out uh, Jed. Pretty sure that's his name. Yeah, we swapped out Jed for Neon. And I upgraded their gear, so that you guys can see their stats and gear for a minute real quick here. Just so you get an idea for how it's going. And surprisingly for Jack, already we've got the Swordsman to level 30. Otherwise for everyone else, like Jed, it's 18. Neon's already 16, I only used her once, but I think she started at level 10. And Ash is already at 23. So yeah, we will actually keep this duelist. Actually, you know what? After thinking about it, I think we actually should equip some stuff on here just, just in case. So that way if I want to... I could swap to that and that style and use it. And yeah, I don't get why it keeps circling. It's like really touchy. I don't get why. There. No. Yes, that works right there. Just stop spinning. <laughs> and, you know, just go level 10 for this too. Uh, remove ashes. Oh, ashes were in that. Um, now we'll just go ahead and use this then. And also before doing anything, I wanted to go into the classes and unlock the skills so that way you guys can see them. So we're gonna get the reinforced command. Combo ability. Another ability. Decrease damage taken. That's helpful. Slash damage increase. Uh, decreases break damage taken with a successful guard. And then... Uh, yes, looks like we got them all. So, now we can actually unlock these. So now we have Knight, Warrior, and Berserker unlocked. Which is cool. Uh, jobs required to unlock. Okay. Might use Anima. Oh, that's right. Anima can be used for uh, experience in these. Forget about that. Got a little experience for sword fire. Increase the infinity. Yeah, that'll help. Uh, shield bash command. Sure. And let's go into duelist. Uh, is that for... Ooh. That's a passive ability. That's helpful. Uh, weak spot mastery. Invincible while attacking weak spot. Yeah. Job affinity. And... Duration. Yep. Uh, oh, good. It updated. Sweet. So yeah, now we actually have access to a few others then. Just because we had some gear on that was actually part of them. So now, besides having our sword fighter, swordsman, and duelist, we have pugilist, pugilist, mage, and lancer. But the thing I don't get then is how do I go over to the warrior class? Unless I have to wait to use that or something? Jobs required to unlock, Swordsman, Ronin. Does that mean both or just one? 
sword fighter, swordsman. Yeah, I don't know. I know those are kind of like hybrid classes, though. Well, mage. That'd be helpful. Downline. But, uh, yeah, with that, we'll go ahead and get back on to the main mission. For now, we gotta do the first story mission here. Which, because of those levels of gear, is why I wanted to do a little bit of grinding. Uh, when Jack and his allies arrive in Provoca, they quickly discover that they are most unwelcome. The only local willing to speak to them is a young boy who screams vitriol and abuse their way. Enduring the child's censure, the party learns that Mayor's son and the boy's father are Paris searching for the crystals on the king's orders. They also earn that learn that one Captain Bick is the man running Provoca now. The company sits out for a nearby grotto that serves as Bick's headquarters in the hopes of extracting information from him. Uh, reward details. That will be the most helpful with anything Pugilist, I gotta say. 23%, that's awesome. And then these are okay. Oh, and really quick too. I actually went to the smithy and dismantled a lot of the pickups I got. And I think of upgrading gear, the only thing I upgraded I think was the Rebellion. Uh, let's go ahead and bring this up then. Soul Burst MP recovery. Insufficient materials. Yeah, that part's something that takes quite a bit, but so far I'd say you're better off just holding off on those. Hmm, that's some interesting stuff right there. Alright, and we're here. So I guess we're heading up to their headquarters We've been walking for a while. Is this the cave the kid was talking about? I don't see any other caves. Let's head in. Yeah, right now we'll just stick with Ash and Neon. See how it goes. Can I break that? Nope, and I wasted that crud. Damn webs! <laughs> that was quick. Nice. You look Quickly almost pick it up level ten. There's one. Jack, let's go. Man, this cave is interesting. I gotta say. Jack, now's your chance. Oh no. Yeah, I've learned how useful it is to stay away from those webs. To pick up. Well, not pick up, but to uh, do that soul thing on them. This. To increase the amount of times you can use your abilities, it's extremely helpful. So the sooner you can get that to max, the easier it is. I barely even got. Ah, crud! I screwed up there. Next. Now there'll be Something's chances. Off here. The air feels wrong. Yeah, it's hard to breathe. Weird. It feels like I've been here before. I've had that feeling before. And it's best not to think about it. You won't figure it out. Oh yeah? Yeah. And right now we need to focus on what's ahead. Forget about it. I can get behind that. Hmm. This place is very interesting. Almost aquatic-like with everything that's it has in here. The plants and everything. Come on, look at that. No sweat. Dang it. Next fight might not be so easy. Yeah, let's go here. Of course. Oh no. Patch ourselves up. Wait, so how long are we poisoned for? Wait, what was Is that people? What's going on here? Look, cubes. Should we take a breather? Uh no, I think we're okay. 
Yeah, yeah, we should. You've not respawned. That's fine. Those what the, the pirates? Be careful. They aren't known for their manners. Just treat them like monsters. If they bear their fangs, knock them out. Well, that was quick. You know what? This is the one. While we're going through here, I should go ahead and use Duelist, actually. Now I can get this up. Style, though. I'll give it that. Check it out, Jack. Wait, check what out. Ah, uh, yeah, I don't think I'll be able to get up there until I go through here. Damn, this smells like strong stuff. Whew. Yeah, strong enough. To Duelist is at least. But at least the gear I have for right now is pretty weak. So it makes it kind of useless. Uh, yeah, we're gonna swap out of that. I think this. Thought they could hide in these. Well, at least just having it equipped helps, too. Uh, I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Holy crap. Okay, so that's an optional way. Uh, we won't go that way, then. Whoa, well... Swordsman is just the way to that go. Was quick. Huh. You look almost disappointed, Jack. At least having it equipped, I'll gain some experience for it, and that'll work enough for me. The swordsman's a decent enough build right now. We need to patch ourselves up. Up ahead. Time to go to work. I think the main thing, though, should be getting the others leveled up in their areas, in their specialties. Uh, I'd say that's the way we're supposed to go, so, you know, let's check over here again. Except this time, be careful. Doing some nice damage with this rebellion. Be a lot tougher if I didn't have it. If I'm being honest. All right, so. Hmm. What? What's in there? Yeah, that's the one I wanted to get. There's a creature up here. Dang it! Sucks. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to give up on that. I know I could probably absorb it and cancel it, but that's nah, a lot of work for that tongue there. I don't think I'll get enough experience to make it worthwhile. Or high enough gear. Keep it up, everyone. But oh well. Shut up. 
Ah, oh, dang it. Want to absorb that Molotov ability. <laughs> Patch ourselves up. Yeah, we'll just keep going through here, though. That's fine enough. Oh, you Can't believe I lost that. Oh, I'm surprised it didn't blow up. I guess only if you have a fire ability equipped. That's all of them. If we can breathe, we can fight again. Look around. We can probably use those stalactites. Yeah, except uh, we don't have any range. So no, no we can't use those select types. So that's for lying, I have mage. And I certainly do not have mage. Dang. That bat seriously... Sorry, not bad. The spider seriously loaded my speed. Win is a win. And that's back to peaceful music. I've never seen anything huh. like this. These pirates sure chose an odd place for their hideout. Yeah, this is strange. Cubes. I'll check it out. Do I want to use them? I don't think we have to. Locked. Okay, so we're looking for a key. What is that thing? This will be rough. This one will test us. Rav Ravenous Coral? Oh, crud. Dang it. Can't let him do that again. There it goes again. Watch out. Yeah, you guys can attack it a bit. That's fine. On, use another ability. Damn it, keep oh no, 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 no. Get off me, get off me. No, 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 no. This looks good. Lucky. Did it swallow this key? Poor thing must have been starving. Pirates didn't care for their kitty. Alright, some enemies have certain areas of their bodies that are weak to attack. For example, attacking a cruel's whiskers will eventually break them, greatly reducing the creature's maximum break gauge. That would have been good to know. The attribute of your attack will also affect how easy or hard it is to break an enemy's weapon spot. In the case of our cruel's feelers, slashing attacks are particularly effective. That's handy to know. Now, after that's done and over with. Let's go. Let's make this entertaining. Oh, well, great. And I missed out on increasing. It's good. You know, I think we're gonna end up just gonna go through the whole place with on two then. That that seems to be how it's gonna be. <laughs> Use the pirate's key. Okay, I went back up here, but then where am I supposed to go? Over there? Oh, I guess so. Okay, works for me. Come out! You have plunder. Ha! Let's see what's inside. Hidden chest. But if I can, I think through this, since you can replay a lot of... Whoa. That 
boat doesn't look like it belongs here. The pirates belong anywhere? Good point. Captain Bicken must be on that ship. Hey, I'll probably try to just speed along through these then, since a lot of these areas, if I miss anything, I can just come back through and replay it. I'll still try to do like a quick look for gear and stuff, but not too extensive. Because I prefer that you guys actually get to see the whole story instead of seeing me having to... Jeez. Hey, I won't, don't want you guys to have to sit through a lot of this stuff. That's uh, completely unnecessary. Well, I could just do it in my own time. Are those cubes? Let's relax for a bit. Aren't we trying to get on the boat, actually? This goes away from the boat, right? Oh no, it goes over there. Okay. What's the point in this direct path? Now this is more of the stuff I want you guys to see. It's where these areas go at least. Seriously? Huh. We can't get across? No. There must be another way. Interesting. The way that it seemed the most direct was actually a way that only led to treasure. Works and uh, works for me. I'd say the characters definitely look good here, though. Oh wait! Fighting style unleashed deadly attacks from sentient stance. Holding R1 with a katana causes you to enter sentient stance. Greatly enhance your attack power. Can chain R2 and R2 spending MP to deal tremendous damage in an instant. Rona have access to powerful. I Geary ability. This technique deals heavy damage, break damage, and can be charged to increase its power. Okay. Good to know. Sorry, I had to do a quick uh, seating and mic adjustment. Kind of craning my neck a little bit. Not too bad, but just enough we're starting to get irritated. Okay, so... Just one black widow? Hmm. Not much for an optional route, then. Fell from there. Hmm. I barely even got going. <laughs> Next. All right, let's pop this bomb, then. There's one. Ourselves for what's ahead. Hmm. Yeah, after playing more of this, then. <sighs> the webs are everywhere. Definitely makes me think on what way would be best for getting the classes up, then. Whether it's just grinding for them or. Oh, darkness is here. Monsters. Uh oh. No. Damn. I was just about to heal, too. Dang it. Yeah, let's just run back there. Next, I'd like to increase that duelist to show you guys some stuff for it, but... Currently, my uh, gear selection for that oh, is well, pretty weak. Yes. To go to work. <laughs> or weaker than these guys. Take more than that to stop us. Good job. 
Now on to the next. I say some of the combos fight. are cool though. The next fight might not be so easy. Look at the size of that thing. Our lives will be easier without it. Uh oh. Might I be able to? Good, got one. Yep, that's just to take these things down right away. Instead of fighting the mobs that come out. Oh, two, it just kills them. We can pick up the gear there. So much easier. Uh, looks like that was all, so let's go yeah, on through. Rum. Whoa. What in the world is this? And actually, I wonder how many areas there actually are here. And actually, after this, we'll probably do a side mission over at that tower. Ah, and here I thought this world was all doom and gloom. Take a good look, because we're headed right back into the thick of it. <laughs> those cubes? Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, we're good. Um, actually... Let's check job trees. Nice. I got two for this. Um... Sure, we'll do that. And then for duelist... Two abilities, uh, was... That's... Wait, what? Really? So it costs three to get down to there? Okay. Works for me. I mean, I won't complain on that. <gasps> I can run out here. The fifth dark crystal. A girl once walked these lands in ages long past, skilled in both sword and sorcery, yet pure of heart. She longed for nothing more than to see that there was a, there was peace and prosperity for all. If her time and place had differed, perhaps her end would have been a happier one. Instead, she perceived the rotting core that blights this world and chose to fall to darkness in hopes that she could lead the people to the light. I saw potential in her plight, and so I gifted her a dark crystal along with a fraction of the truth. Yes, I used her, but for good purpose. The crystal allowed her to be reborn time and time again, and more importantly, laid the fourth and final karmic piece on a board that will one day lead my dear friend to an inevitable conclusion. That's interesting, because this says fifth dark crystal, and currently we only have four. So it means... Well, I didn't expect that to happen. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's heal up. Can I go over there? Please let me get over there. Okay, I can just barely make out platforms. This looks good. That's kinda stupid. Ooh. Blessed vestment? What? Who can wear that? Can I wear that? Ooh. Good for Mage. That's good for Ronin. Hmm. Let's go ahead and wear this. I like. Let's go by equipment level. Yeah, I'm getting a lot of stuff for Ronin here. Interesting. And let's do Twilight Headband. Oh, interesting. So if you get the percents high enough, you can actually get various stat boosts from each one. That's cool. Go with some Ronin. And here we'll go with 
that. Yeah, no, we're gonna go with this. And I think Rebellion is still our strongest, right? Yep. Let's go to his real quick. 10, give him the 12. Twilight headgear. Let's go ahead and give him this. <laughs> Had to back up a little bit. I got a little close to the TV there. Or the screen, I guess I could say. Action ability, MP costs. Uh, increased drop rate, that won't be bad. Level 10 trousers. Level 12 boots, sure. Combo abilities, he gets what he gets. Uh, she doesn't have a new helmet. Ooh. She can get way better there. Yeah, she got a bonus there. Sweet. Even though Jed's not currently on the team, we'll still go ahead and give our guy some stuff here. worthwhile to have on, really. Okay. Now to carefully go through the water again. Without dying. There we go. Spiders up there. Come on. We can go right. What the? Uh, Alpha Wolf. Great. Just great. Oh, damn. I'm dealing some serious damage. Yeah, let's go. Oh, and we're increasing the MP? Oh, yeah, that's all. That's fantastic right there. Miss Sahagan stands no chance. Man, I hate this auto lock on. It quickly changes to another enemy. And it shouldn't. Ooh. Not something to keep in mind. Don't stand underneath a black widow. It will hurt you when it falls in. Okay. So let's pick up the gear. And we'll keep on going then. And yeah, we're just about on the boat. There's one. We'll be surrounded in Get it over. Yep, let's just break this thing now, though. Ooh, I don't need to go up here, but... Oh, sweet, that's a shortcut. Fantastic. So close, yet so far. Yeah. Just 
by taking out that thing, we can just get rid of him right away. Instead of having to waste our time killing him. I have a feeling this will be a boss. That's some boat. Ha ha ha! You've got some stones coming here. For what it's worth, you four don't look like easy pickings. Your big eh? Aye, to some. Captain, to you lot. We're looking for the crystals. We were supposed to find the mayor, but I guess he's dead. Looks like you have the run of the town now. Aye, that's the world we live in. Where people have to turn to pirates for guidance. Pure chaos, if you ask me. Chaos, savvy? <laughs> Just tell us where the crystals are. <laughs> it's poor fool not to laugh at a pirate's joke, Sland. <laughs> hmm. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> You got stones, all right. Ah. Ooh, pretty spry for a big captain. I'm gonna wanna be careful and keep my distance, son. I don't wanna get hit by his attacks. Ooh, that was close. Did I still get hurt by the captain? Shouldn't have. Get out of there, guys. You got it. Ooh, my calls for assist. I'm almost out of potions. I'm like a nervous pirate, so that way I'll call for assistance again. That's the perfect time to get him. No one bruises my crew but me. Time to teach you the rules of the sea. No one more. My captain should go down with the ship. My ears are catching up to me. Damn it up, Captain. Nice finish around the captain. That is? Nothing else? Might be the end, actually. Plunder and booty left to steal. We're getting soft, but that fight got my juices flowing. Cheers. You want to know about Christians? Astos is your man. This boat will take you right to his doorstep. Astos. Friend of yours? No. Never heard of him. Calls himself King of the Dark Elves. Not elves, mind you. Dark. That's the difference. It depends on who you ask. Some say he drank the lifeblood of fifty score of his king. Some say he made a deal with chaos. Stories and legends abound. What kind of deal? You want the truth of it? Ask him yourself. This journey might not be a waste after all. Alright, I think that's it for that level then.
Sure feels like it. Yep, that's it. Eh, got some gear that could be useful. Mainly for Ash, though. Main mission, audience with the Dark Elf. This mission is now available. 